The Gospel of Elohim is rapidly unraveling and the book of Revelations chapter 17. Revelation 17 1, and Elohim, the Sovereign One, the seven archangel came and Elohim was talking to me. And while Elohim was talking to me Elohim, he had the seven vials in his hand. And Elohim said to me come, John. Come here and I Elohim will show you the judgment of the whore. The church, the church is them, that are committed idolatry and also all the inhabitants of the earth. And also those with whom the whore, the church. The church of Gesu, with the Pope and the kings of earth and the people and all the churches them that are committing idolatry. And I Elohim will show you who is making all the earth to commit idolatry and how the inhabitants them are drinking rum and wine. 17 2, and how the Pope and the kings them are drunken with wine. And how the people are drunken with rum and wine and with their fornication and their adultery and with their food and their rum and their wine, with the prophets from their formation of their great corporations them. And with their food and rum and wine with which they, from the Pope and the kings of the earth and the church, the church of Gesu, the great whore is drunken with. And also the churches and all the people of the world which the great whore, the church, the church of Gesu, that is sitting upon the waters, the nations them in the world. Revelation 17 3, So Elohim carried me away on his spirit, the cherub, the chariot of Elohim where I John saw the beast, the devil and the whore, the woman who is sitting and ruling with the seven heads and the ten horns, within the world, the nation governments of the world, the ten horns of power. And the woman, the whore, the church of Gesu, the Vatican City, and the Pope. And also those in the wilderness with the beast, the devil, that were worshipping Allah, God God real, the beast, that I, John saw in the wilderness, and the woman was full of the blasphemous names. And with all the names of Jesus. And when I saw where the woman, the whore was, it was full of blasphemies Revelation 17 4, and the woman, the whore, the mother church, the church of Gesu, it was arrayed in purple and scarlet color, and decked with gold and precious stones and pearls and with carvings and paintings. And the woman had a golden cup in her hand, which was full of her abominations and with filthiness and with her fornication. Revelation 17 5, And upon forehead of the woman, the whore, the church of Gesu, there was a mysterious name, written, in Latin, the mother church, the church of Gesu the mother of the churches and the societies of Jesuit, Jesus, Gesu, and the harlots, with the whores of the great Babylon and the organizations of abomination in the earth, and the nations of Babylon in the earth. Revelation 17 6, And I John saw the woman, the whore, the church, the Vatican, Vatican City, drunken with the blood of the people of Elohim, the Hebrews, the Elohim Israelites, and also with the blood, the death of the martyrs of Elohim. And also those who were servants for Jesus. 17:7. And when I saw her, the city. I John saw the people worshipping Jesus. And I John wondered with great admiration. Revelation 17:8. And Elohim, the holy angel said unto me, Why did you marvel? I will therefore tell you the mystery of the woman, and the beast that is carrying, and carting, that is doing business with the church there. And with whom the beast is carrying and carting with which have the seven heads and ten horns. Revelation 17 9, The beast that thou saw was, and is not. And shall ascend out of the bottomless pit, and shall go into perdition, and they that dwell on the earth shall wonder, after the beast those whose names were not written in the book of life from the foundation of the world. And when they shall behold the beast that was, and is not, and yet is. Revelation 17 9, and here is parable for the minds that have wisdom. The seven heads are seven mountains, on which the woman is sitting. Revelation 17 10, and there are seven kings, five are fallen, and one is, and the other is not yet come. And when he comes he must continue a short space. Revelation 17 11, and the beast that was, and is not, even he is the eighth, and is of the seven, and shall go into perdition. Revelation 17:12. And the ten horns which thou saw are the ten kings, which have not received any kingdom as yet.
but will receive power as kings one hour with the beast to fight against Elohim, kingdom. Revelation 17:13. and these shall have one mind, and shall give their power and strength unto the beast. Revelation 17:14. and these shall make war with Elohim Olam and the Elohim shall overcome them, because Elohim is king of kings, and they that are with Elohim shall laud Elohim because Elohim is sovereign and Elohim shall reign over them and they shall laud Elohim over and over again because they were called, and were chosen, and because Elohim is sovereign and is faithful. Revelation 17:15. And Elohim said unto me, John, the waters which thou saw where the whore is sitting are peoples, and multitudes, and nations, and tongues. Revelation 17:16. And the ten horns which you saw upon the beast, these shall hate the whore, the church, and shall make her desolate and naked, and shall eat her flesh, shall consume her, shall destroy her, the church of Gesu and they shall burn it with fire. Revelation 17:17, 17, 17, Because Elohim have put in their hearts to fulfill his will, and Elohim shall make God God real and Jesus to give up. And the people them the nations them that gave up their kingdom to the beast, they also shall all give up, they and the beast but not until the words of Elohim shall be fulfilled. Revelation 17:18. And the woman, the whore, and the harlot, the Vatican city that you saw is that great city, Babylon which is the city with the church of Gesu and with the Pope. And also the kings and the heads of the nations them and the heads of the states them and also the government them of the world which are ruling in the earth.